just laid out right before your eyes. Thousands of years of history. What a Every waste time. of beautiful panna. Last time I dropped it too. I'm just not meant to It's okay. Right? Look how cute this little chubby bunny is. He's so cute. Look at all these biscotti. Incrustate. They look good. Hello, paparazzi. Hello, yes. Paparazzi. Jen, you're yeah, you gotta worry. Don't worry. Jen, these guys, these guys here. Jen, get ready. You're good. La nonna? Ti cucino io tutto. Sono la nonnina. The real deal. Yeah. Buongiorno. What are you eating? Cocomero. Cocomero. This pizzeria is literally right on our street of Via del Governo Vecchio. We asked for uh, pizza, cipolla, funghi e salsiccia. This is a very popular pizzeria. Lots of people are eating outside. We're going to take it to go and eat it on our terrace because it's rammed in here. But yeah, it should be good. This is how they make the pizza, buffetta. <laughs> wow, it looks so good. See, it's all going in the oven. And the Romano pizza is literally paper thin. Mm. So this is the pizza da buffetto with fungi, salsiccia, cipolla. Mushrooms, a sausage, and onions. Looks so good. And look how thin this is. It's like paper thin. See? It's famous, apparently. Yum! Well, da buffetto. This pizza is delicious. This is how I eat it, just fold oh. it up. Normally you can eat a pizza all to yourself, but we decided to split one because we're always having late days and we actually want to have a nice big dinner tonight. This pizza, don't think that it's dry because it's so thin. It's actually so juicy mm, and delicious. So Highly mm. recommended. 
so good. Yum. So after a long day of exploring the beautiful Rome, we are now off to dinner. This is technically going to be our first official dinner where we actually sit down and eat at a restaurant in Rome. So I'm very excited about that. We are craving pasta. So we're going to a really good place called Osteria da Fortunata for some pasta. It's pretty close to our B&B, so we're excited about that. Um, get in my belly. Hi, the little Lee. Hello, we're at Hello. Osteria da Fortunata. We came here last year and we got this torta petti and they were so good. We're back again. So we're back again. This time I'm getting carbonara. And then there's a lady behind me making the pasta fresh. See, she rolls it fresh. So every pasta is literally made fresh right before your eyes. I'm zooming in. If you're craving pasta, you can't go wrong. Beautiful. Lisa e la bella mammina. Here's my delicious carbonara. There's my mom's pesto alla tagliolini. This is Giulia's tipo gricia with pierogi zucca. It sort of has like um, guanciale, pecorino, and zucchini flowers, and today it has carbonara as well. And look how delicious this looks. This is strezza preti, and it's made in hand. So delicious. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're finishing the meal with a nice tiramisu and a nice coffee and a nice coffee, right? Okay. Yummy. This one is the moretto, and you're having the chocolate. Yeah, to go because I miss Starbucks, but not that much. Okay, I love Italy. We're in this piazza right now, and it's so pretty. There's some really happening restaurants and bars. They look super cute. It's a nice vibe. This is the market of Campo We're early enough to actually see it today, so that's pretty cool. This is where they sell all kinds of things and foods and flowers and everything. So they go. I'm so excited. Yeah. I'm My mom is going in the pantheon. She had her little shoulder showing, so we tucked them into her. <laughs> Let's see this guy's looking at her. <laughs> this guy's looking at her like she's so weird. Okay, now she's going into the Pantheon. I've been in here many times and now I can't go because I'm actually showing my shoulders for once, which is a shame, but that's okay. So what? <laughs> so little mom went in. The gorgeous Pantheon, how cool. Not too many tourists right now. 10.30, okay, so the earlier the better. waiting for our mom. She's taking forever in the Pantheon. <laughs> we finally see her now. We are on our way to the Trevi Fountain. To make a wish so we can Fountain. come back to Rome. <laughs> Trevi Fountain. Woo! Camilla d'Italia! This is sort of in 
between the Trevi Fountain and Pantheon. The Salotto Quarantadua is actually very nice to get a drink. They make some pretty cool drinks in there. Trevi Fountain! Look how beautiful! I love it! There's not that many people right now. Hello from the Trevi Fountain! It's so beautiful here. This is how they make it in the little machines right here. So we made it to the top of Piazza de España. From up here, there's a lovely view. I'll show you. We are doing a band-aid stop. <laughs> Because you just get blisters in Rome. Hi, Jen. Hi. Jill's doing her little blister. Hi, Mom. Hi, Nick. Catch the sun. You look at her little mini legs. Woo! <laughs> mini Godna. From the Spanish steps again. <laughs> we were trying to get to Piazza del Popolo. We saw that big thing, we thought we were there, but we're on. We were at the top of the Spanish steps, so we got to see a lovely view of Rome from above. And now we're walking down the steps. Pumpy! I'm getting a nice tiramisu so that I can eat for breakfast tomorrow in our Airbnb. <laughs> and this is what I'm getting, pistachio. Yummy! We went to Daba Fetto again and we brought it back to our terrace. So oh. here we go, our delicious pizza. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look how good. And we even got some mozzarella and some burrata from the grocery oh. store. Yum! Dig in. Tonight is our last official night in Rome until later on in our trip when we actually get back in. We stay here for our last two nights before we head home to Toronto. But tonight, for all purposes, is our last night in Rome. So we're just going out for a very simple gelato <laughs> before we leave because I love gelato and I can never get enough. So we're gonna do a little passeggiata near our area, grab a gelato, and then we're gonna come home early and pack because we are off to Como tomorrow, Lake Como. We have a long train right ahead of us. Lago di Como. <laughs> Lago di Como, exactly. Okay, so I will see you guys with either a gelato or tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah, crema limone. Mm. Wow. This is for Johnny. Maybe I should get it in his, in his honor. Okay, so I got the ricotta pere for Johnny. And this one is pistacchio di bronte, which is really Julia's. Good. And? And Cubano, which Cubano. is chocolate rum. And I got so chocolate good. arancia and ricotta pere for little Mama, Johnny. She got nocciola and I think bacio. So good. Looks so good. Mmm. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my God. Eating my lovely gelato with a dog, with a dog pooping behind me. <laughs> it's so good. Right there. Pretty cool. Yummy. Store Aperol spritz, their little pre made 
with alcohol in them already. So, so that cheap. is it was so like cool. four euro. Yeah, isn't that amazing? Four or five euro for three Aperol spritz. Yeah, so it's basically pre-made and we should really have these in Canada. These are my favorite. <laughs> We finally have our tiramisu from Pompey. They got strawberry and I have pistacchio. Today we're doing a quick colazione in our Airbnb because we are leaving and heading off to Termini station to take the train to Bellagio. This natural lighting, you might be able to see it better. This is the pistachio tiramisu. Mmm, looks so good. This is our view from our Airbnb. <laughs> Look at these layers of this creamy mascarpone tiramisu. Then the strawberry one with all the nice strawberries so on it. This tiramisu is pretty famous in Rome. They call it Il Re di Tiramisu, which means the king of tiramisu. So we are at Termini Station. We are quite early actually. So we have a lot of time to kill. And uh, I'm just having my little cafe con ginseng right now. I love this ginseng cafe ginseng. is our addiction in Italy. It's so good. And the best part is, is that at the station, just go upstairs, go where the coffee shops are, the bars are, have a nice coffee at a nice table because downstairs there's not even a bench to sit on. So if you're ever at Termini Station, come upstairs and get a coffee. <laughs>